More local news. A Warwick-based graphics company has teamed up with the Lieutenant Governor's Office launching a new initiative to help small businesses impacted by the coronavirus. It's called Gift It Forward. Eyewitness News reporter Alexander Leslie joins us now from Pawtucket with the details. Oceanside Graphics went from laying off its employees to hiring them back in the course of about a week. While they may not have the same volume right now, one of the owners tells me the company has reinvented itself. Oceanside Graphics is a sign and banner company based in Warwick. Last week, business slowed down in a major way. All of our larger customers that we get our work from have you know, pulled all our contracts. Co-owner Justin Gunterick found himself in a position many small businesses have. We had to lay off all our 1099 workers. It hurts, you know, it, it's, not, it's not an easy thing to do. Last week, Lieutenant Governor Dan McKee joined Gunterick and about 30 other small businesses on the phone to come up with a plan to make money in the short term. And we came up with the uh, Gifted Forward and by Rhode Island program. If you log on to rismallbusiness.org, small business owners can register so customers can purchase gift cards. You can also nominate local businesses to be included. And larger companies who want to help can submit the contact info to be paired with a business in need. But just in a couple hours, we have uh, just about 50 people that have registered. It's a ray of sunshine in, in a dark time. Oceanside is getting creative with other projects, too. The company started producing medical face shields. Gonteric says the plastic is FDA approved. At a time where our business is really going to be stagnant for, you know, we don't know how long, this is something that can push us through. The company says it already has orders and it plans to donate them to businesses in need, including nursing homes. I'm Alexandra Leslie, Eyewitness News.